Saturday, which means it is which day? Christian and Olivera Day. Well, most Saturdays. And today we're off to a lake. So I will bring you there. First we're gonna eat though. So let's go get some food. Ready? Yes. Let's go. Hey, there are, can you hear your son? He's been screaming at the top of his lungs. Hey, there are kids where you know. So here we are in, I actually have no idea. Where are we? Well, first and dumb. What he said. That's the Kadivi. Ah, by the Kadivi, which is apparently the biggest or most famous. No, I think, I think the most famous. The most famous, the famous mall in Germany. Entire Germany? Yeah. Why is the one? Anyway, let's eat some food. Take So we have currently come to this place called Fancy Donuts and I had to get the most boring option because it's the only vegan one and then Christian's got this like whoo, really bougie looking one and how is the coffee? I have no idea because like the thing is with the oat milk, the oat milk is kind of like foamier than normal milk and that's why she's a bit shook. It doesn't work. But like she's trying it again now with like the oat milk. So basically they do this thing here where um, oh, you can shit. get, yeah. You can get a photo of <laughs> oh, wow. of um, whatever you want on your latte. So we edited a picture of Ocho and we wanted to get it on the latte, but apparently, obviously, as you said, because of the oat milk, it's too foamy, so the art can't stay on the surface. I really want it to work, please, because it's so hot. I feel like it's not going to work. She's really shook about it. Oh, she's so How shook. is it? It's good. I can see him. I can see him too. Melanka now and we are admiring this street because honestly it has some of the nicest houses that I've ever seen and we're just like mm, one day we'll have ours whoa look at this one and we're just like I guess dreaming about one day having our own and then obviously having like a nice garden for Ocho and building him like a playground I'm excited. Grunewald and Zielendorf are really nice areas and also quite expensive areas yeah. to live and has this kind of touch, like it's a village touch, you know, mm -hmm. where it's quite calm but very close to the city. So like the price per square meter here is very, very high uh -huh. compared to other places. But it's nice though, not gonna lie. Christian, you're in the shop picking your nose. <laughs> to find a really relaxing and just peaceful empty area here this lake is so much nicer than the one we went to the first time we went to a lake so the first time we went to Weisensee which is actually very hyped and a very popular lake I would say the cons of it is that you have to pay entry which is okay it's five euro fifty we also had to queue up for two hours to just get to the lake which I think is a little bit weird for a lake <laughs> and this one's so much nicer less people just less crowded and the water is so much cleaner like the water is crazy clean I haven't gone in and I don't think I will unfortunately because it's that time of the month and I just don't really feel like swimming I'm just enjoying sitting here to be honest Christian's having a little dip. 
How is it? I will dip my feet in it though to see the temperature, but I absolutely love this so much. It's so nice here. Your morning shines in city clothes. Cheese. I've never liked it for some reason. I don't know what it is. I've always hated the smell of it, the taste of it. So we got this cheese by Simply V. It doesn't smell like Parmesan, I wouldn't say. Mmm. Mmm. It's good, right? Mm hmm Does this taste like Parmesan to you? Mm. It's a weird taste, right? Mm, weird. Like as an unusual. That tastes good though. It tastes good. It's difficult to explain, but it's really good for on pizza. It's like the perfect thing. You can no, see. No, it's not perfect for pizza. For sorry. Pa Why is my brain today? Oh my god, sorry, pasta, not pizza. There's a different one for pizza that's more like shredded, bigger pieces. I'm loving it. Thanks for making it. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, movie time. Oh my god, he's so cute. Okay. Ugh, okay. Three, two, one, go. go. So whenever we have movie nights, we bring out the blow-up mattress and we make it all cozy and it is so much more comfortable. If you ever experience an uncomfortable couch, get yourself a blow-up mattress, which we actually have for guests. Whenever they visit, they sleep in the living room on this or in the bed, depending if it's like our parents, they always get the bedroom and we sleep on this. But if it's just like friends and stuff, we usually give them this so they have their privacy here in the living room. <laughs> anyway, we are about to watch a little movie. Got the young fella with us. Hey handsome. It's actually quite a cozy one, I'm not gonna lie. Ugh, I love it. It's so much more comfy. He's a bit nervous of climbing onto this. It's not like a normal bed, so he gets a bit weird about it. Yay! There's my boy. My boy. Love you so much. Sit around the fire, your side, really feeling that I like every little time that I get a chance to close my eyes. If you're gonna make it 
soon Maybe we could get our room But I need some rest 